I am frustrated. Here I am. I just moved seven months ago. I busted my ass to make this place look like it does. And I got to move because I'm not safe being here. There is no way we are safe being here. There's nothing in there, is there? Turn the hog on and see if anything comes out of there. It's hard to say. How clean is it? I can't tell you. Do I believe them that it's all good? There is no way. No way I believe them. We're not getting any truth. They, the, they are not going to own up to what's going in there until they are forced to. And if people don't voice their opinions and they don't get pounded by real officials, they're not going to tell you the truth. I mean, around here, there's a lot of great people around here. I just, being this close to the, the train derailment, I don't trust it. I mean, my two-year-old can talk, but he can't say, hey, I got a headache, or I'm dizzy, or lightheaded, or my eyes are burning, nothing like that. I mean, he'll start crying, but it could be a number of things. Water is the big thing here right now. Everybody is wanting water. They don't want to drink the water. They don't want to give it to their animals, you know. Whoever comes in from the community, they're getting the first case of water free. And then um, the, he, up to three other um, cases of water will be at our cost at $2. And it's just to help out because, you know, some people are leery about the water right now. We went through 10 pallets of water yesterday. Yeah, so, and then we have another 10 pallets for today. So, and we're gonna try to keep doing this as long as we can. This is worse than what everybody thought it was. And the people in town are afraid. They are afraid. I'm afraid, I'm afraid for my family down in Negley. Uh, it's just, you know, it's something that this little town, I don't think expected to ever happen.